In this video, I will show you Selene UI, a sleek free tool that makes customizing your Windows desktop fast and easy. You've probably heard of My Doc Finder, great macOS style look, but it's paid. Or Screen Styler, which hasn't been updated in ages. Selene UI changes the game, modern, smooth and completely free. If you're ready to refresh your setup, this is the tool to try. But before we get started, like and subscribe because it really helps the algorithm. And now let's jump in. First of all, go to this link, which I will also put in the video description down below. And now once you are here on this website, just simply scroll down and here on the right side, you will see releases link. Click on it and then down below here, you will find first Selene UI nightly release. This is in pre-release and it's highly unstable. So make sure that you scroll down down below and here you will find Selene UI. The current version as of recording this video is version 2.3.5. Now here, just click on the assets and down below, we will find two setup files. Now you guys can go with this file MSIX or you can also go with Selene UI 2.3.5x64 setup file. Now, I highly recommend that you go with this one, or you guys can also install this application from the Microsoft Store as well. But Microsoft Store, it's a bit slow on the update side. So I highly recommend to download this exe file or MSIX. Once you have the file, you can go and navigate to your downloads folder and double left click on the setup file here. Now you will get the message Windows protected your PC. Just click here on more information and then click here to run anyway. Now just follow the installation instructions. Now once you successfully install Selene UI on your computer, just navigate here to the start menu, click here on all and down below make sure that you search for Selene UI. Here it is and now you should see your wallpaper change as well as a brand new dock at the bottom and also a menu bar on top. Now here on the first page you will find the release notes as well as some of the resources. Here under the general you guys can enable run on startup make sure that this is enabled and you guys can also go here under the resources but I will talk about them later in the video so make sure that you stay tuned for that. Now let's talk about fancy toolbar so fancy toolbar is this toolbar at the top you guys can just simply disable it like so and click on save and it should hide from your desktop but I think that it looks very very cool so you can just enable it right here and just click on save and then here you have two options so height and the position you guys can change the height if you want to and the position you guys can position the toolbar at the bottom of the screen and then you guys can also enable auto hide which is currently set to never now let's talk about application manager you guys can also enable that if you want to and also they included the wallpaper manager so here you guys can use use the wallpapers which are included in Selene UI. However, you guys can click here on plus and add your own wallpapers to the Selene UI. Just like this wallpaper right here, which is the part of my wallpaper pack. And you guys can check it out by clicking the first link in the video description below. Now, down below, we will also find dock and task bar settings. Now, if you don't like it, you guys can just simply disable it. And here you guys can change the width. Currently set to small, but you guys can change this to full screen. And then once you've changed that, you guys can click on save and here you will see how the taskbar at the moment looks like here on the right you will have this no playing widget and here you will have the open apps and here on the left you will see the start menu you of course can change the margin and the padding as well and then down below you can change the item size and also space between items but i will show you how to install a transparent theme for the taskbar or this dock later in the video and then here you also have the window manager which is also included in Selene UI, but currently this feature is not available on my Windows version because I'm on ARM Windows version at the moment. And by the way, guys, you guys can also change the dock and taskbar position to wherever you want on the screen. For example, we can even move it here to the right side of the screen, which I think looks very, very cool and can also auto hide it. So for example, if you set here to always, you can click on save and right now it should hide. And now if you go with your mouse over the right edge, it should pop up just like so. Now here you guys can go to themes and then make sure that you click here on this link and then you will be redirected to this website and I highly recommend that you could just disable this part of the link right here and click on the enter and you will be redirected here to the default resources page. Now here down below are a few of the resources which I highly recommend to install. For example, one of them is Wave Animation for Taskbar. So you guys can just click on it and then click here on download.
download and make sure that you enable this option always allow Celine IO to open Celine UI URA links and click on open link and this should open inside the Celine UI and I'll just wait for a few seconds and you guys can see here that a new resource has been added and click here on enable now what this will do it will add this really nice wave animation to your taskbar so let's see if it already is enabled and you guys can see here down below we just added this really cool animation for our opened applications inside the dock now we are not done yet here so just go back here to the resources and let's click on this one which i think looks also very very cool it's called round toolbar and what this will do it will add this really cool effect to our toolbar at the top of our screen so you guys can just go here and let's click on download button to install this toolbar on our celine ui program and click here on enabled and you guys can see here what this looks like we have here date and the clock on top and we have this really cool faded effect on our calendar then if you click here on the three dots you will see here the system tray and here you have the language you have the bluetooth internet access you have the volume control and if you click on this you have also volume settings you guys can see here the really cool menu from this menu you guys can go directly for example to downloads folder to documents folder desktop and i think this is really really well made now the next resource or theme which i highly recommend to install is this one right here by the same developer as the round toolbar and if you go here down below you guys can download this one so it's called transparent celine theme and you guys can click here on download and install this one as well click here to enable and i'll just wait for a few seconds and you guys can see how the menu bar actually changed as well as the taskbar here at the bottom or the dock also changed to transparent now inside celine ui you will also find settings for this resources which you have installed for example you guys can go here to wave animation and here you guys can change the dock item zoom size to for example let's go with 100 here and if i click on save you can see here right now how the icons get bigger compared to before where this setting was set to 60 and you guys can also change the round toolbar to for example text color or even glow color to the white as well so let's just change that to white for example click here and then change the text color to 0 0 0 0 0 and click on saves and you guys will see how this change right now now i think that this is pretty much it for celine ui i think it looks very very nice and it also works really really good on my computer at least now i can also show you the system monitor and if i go here to the task manager i can also just show you how many of the resources celine ui actually takes so for example here i have celine ui you guys can see here two items so celine wag and also fancy toolbar it takes 103 megabytes of memory and 2.5 of the cpu which isn't as much so i think it's definitely worth installing to your computer and please let me know in the comment section what do you actually think about celine ui it's a great replacement for default taskbar or not and with that said i will leave a link for the celine ui in the video description down below and if you guys haven't already make sure that you smash up the like button and subscribe to the channel because it really helps the algorithm have an amazing rest of your day and i will see you all around in the next video